So for problem five, the idea is that we're trying to estimate t prime of three using the given data. I didn't write all the data down. It's on the handout or the practice final. Um, so if you're trying to find the derivative at three, you're trying to find the slope of the tangent line at three. And the idea is basically that if you pick the points that are closest to three, but not actually three, because, well, there's reasons I don't want to get too deeply into it. But essentially the idea is if you pick the points closest to the left and right of three, which are at 2.99 and 3.01, those are going to give you the best estimate if you calculate the slope between those two lines of the slope of the tangent line. So the way we're going to do that is we're going to calculate t of 3.01, which is 0 0.1076 and t of 2.99, which is 1 .0, 0.1066. So we're gonna do write the difference in the t values divided by the difference in the p values, or in other words, the rise right, from here to here over the run from here to here, right? So it's here to here, here to here. So that's gonna be 0 0.1076 minus 0 0.1066 divided by 3.01 minus 2.99. Um, so doing calculations, we're going to get, let's see, this is going to be 0 0.0010 divided by, oh, sorry, the light just turned on a little bit more. Um, let's see, 3.01 minus 2.9 is 0 0.02. This seems terrible, so I would probably move things over a little bit. And I feel like my slope might be off a tiny bit. I feel like I might be making an error here. Let me double check. Maybe not. Um, point zero zero one. No, I think there's an error in the solutions. To be perfectly honest, that's I think what's actually happening. So point zero zero one divided by point zero two. If I move the decimal over one two three places, one two three places, I'm going to get one over twenty. The solutions say one half or point five. That's actually incorrect. It should be one over twenty. So make note of that. So that's it. To find the slope of the tangent line, or to approximate the slope of the tangent line. You pick the points closest to the points of interest and you find the slope between those two points.